Um, Masaki asked, is one able to ordain with a medical condition such as epilepsy that they take medicine for? I'll start now. Um, yeah, it's, it's possible to meditate. The, the question, of course, is what the medication does to your mind. I would, I would, if possible, much rather have, especially with epilepsy, have a person slowly begin to wean themselves off the med medication in favor of the meditation. And when an epileptic fit occurs, because as I understand, they're mainly physical. You know, I don't know how it affects the mind, and maybe you can enlighten us, but if you're having an epileptic fit and you're still able to be mindful of it, then just be mindful of it as best you can. You know, you, if you want to take some medication, then take some medication. But uh, to ordain, oh, I think that oh. is not allowed. I'm not right, really yeah, sure it's, that it's, I think this is it's not possible when you have epilepsy. This is one of the questions oh, of it? the sicknesses. Oh, it is. Oh, okay, so it's a simple I, answer. No, you as can't. As far as I think. It depends how extreme it is, I suppose. If you can find, a, if if you can, if you can, we, we should do this as a test. What I said, we'll practice meditation. I'm sorry, I mis misread the question, but when, do that as a test. If if through meditation practice, your epilepsy is. Um, well, even cured, then you could ordain, because the word is just a word. No, if if certain things occur in the body, they m may change over time. Of course, these sicknesses. If if a person becomes cured of these things, then they can ordain. So you should test it out in the meditation, see how uh, your meditation practice affects it, because you should certainly have these things dealt with before you ordain. Taking uh, having any condition for which you have to take. Um, medication for, which you have to take, or, or in order to function properly, have to take medication for is, is a real sign that you shouldn't, you, you, you may not be able to ordain, because you can't be sure that you're going to get that medication, uh, even though you'll be allowed to, you know, there's allowances to ask for it and so on. It's, uh, it becomes a burden, and, it, and because of the uncertainty of being a monk and the necessity of being content with whatever you get, makes it uh, quite a, a burden to the Sangha and a barrier to your own ability to carry out all of the duties of a monk and keep the hundreds of rules and and the practices and the um, the communal uh, lifestyle. Mm. There are certain sicknesses I don't remember all. Leprosy is one and uh, uh, ringworms, I think, is one. So there are certain, uh, and I think epilepsy is one of them. There are certain sicknesses you can not have, uh, or if you have them, you cannot ordain. There is a, a part of the ordination procedure where you questions: Do you have this? Do you have that? And, um, and if you say yes. I do, then you'll probably be advised not to ordain them. Okay. 